Save money while you stay warm this winter by winterizing your home. News 13's Ingrid Allstead joins us live in Arden where she's done some shopping. Ingrid? That's right, Darcel. I walked into the Lowe's behind me. I purchased this weather strip. It was actually very affordable, about $2. A great tip to save some money this winter to also push out the cold and keep in the warm. To avoid a high power bill, think low. Sealed it to the top of the piers. Marcus Renner is working to air seal Becky Brown's crawl space. Cold air won't be able to travel from here to here. Next, work your way up. Marcus says the attic is the most important place to seal. This house has had that done, so it's now pretty airtight, and they actually have not turned on their heat today. Next on the list, check your windows. Always make sure in the winter that we lock our windows. If you don't lock them, you're not pulling these two together. I've solved somebody's $800 a month heating bill by just going around and locking their windows. If you feel a breeze, you may need to replace the seals. You can see this white piece of uh, foam there. Check your doors, too. We want to make sure the door jam, the door comes again against the door stop here and that you have some kind of flexible seal. And don't forget the crack under your door. For a few dollars, you can block the chill with a sweep. And Becky is not only saving money, she's making money thanks to the solar panels she's installed on top of her house. It's a big investment, but for her, it's paid off. Now for the last several months, we've actually had a credit on our um, bills. She also credits winterizing her home. It's definitely worth it. it um, yeah, it decreased our bills, and like I said, we, we use less energy, and we can see that on a monthly basis, so um, the house just feels better. A nice, warm feeling. And don't forget to protect your plumbing as well. Here's a couple tips for you right now. Make sure your foundation vents are closed and disconnect those hoses from the outside faucets. We have more money-saving tips for you on our website, WLOS.com. Reporting live in Arden, Ingrid Allstead, News 13.